Susan Huff with Living Your Gifts, and I was just reflecting on one of the best decisions I ever made in my life. I read Simone Fusome's book, The Spirit of Intimacy, and then I read Welcoming Spirit Home, and it made me so excited about how in this village, women gather and a child speaks through the mother what the gift is. And I was working with teenagers at the time, and I tell you, my heart just blew open when I read that part. And I got driven. Like, it's the oddest thing that I've never felt so compelled to do something in my life. And it was actually kind of scary. I thought, mm, I'm going to go find this woman, and I gave my the book to everybody, and I'm going to go find her, and I'm going to... Uh, I'm, I'm going to make her be a part of my life in some way. And I did that. And we were friends for 19 years. I became uh, on her nonprofit. We started projects together. And um, she was my mentor, my teacher. Um, she was just the best. And my point of this whole story of telling you that something got ignited in me, don't miss an opportunity. When something gets ignited in you, you, there's a reason for it. It's almost like my, my ancestors were pushing me to do something different. And in that, it changed everything for me. It made my life more full, it made me happier, and it gave me so many blessings. So when something pushes you, when you feel so passionate about something, don't let your fear get in the way because it's so easy to do that because you just don't know what that push may have in store for you. So that's it for today. Let your passion lead you. And we'll see you at livingyourgifts.com.